What's up, Geminis? This is Evolving Wisdom. Yes, I am here to do your mid-June reading. I'm going to do things a little different today, just slightly different. I've been playing around with these cards. Okay, I don't do it the traditional way. Um, pretty much just look at the pictures and see what's going on, what energy I pull from the pictures instead of reading from the book that is sent from the cards. I can't I don't work that way. I pretty much look at pictures, I look at energy, and I can figure out from there what is need to be said or what message needs to be given to my Geminis, okay? All right, so don't crucify me, you guys. I am still working with these cards, so. All right, let's see what message my Geminis have. What message, all right. So we have the high priestess here. So someone is um, coming into their power. Someone is figuring out or understanding that the power that they have within them. And you're coming into your energy here, okay? You're coming into your power. <clears throat> or I can look at this also too as someone is working their magic. Someone is bringing what they want, the the dreams and all everything that they want. They're bringing it to themselves, the working through magic, okay? All right, so we have the hangman here for my Gemini's. So one is just, you're just sitting there and you're waiting here. As you can see, like this person is <clears throat> just hanging there. They have the key to unlock themselves. So <clears throat> I kind of get the feeling that you're in, you're, you have yourself in bondage, unnecessary bondage, where, where there's really no, there's really nothing that's holding you back, okay? So you're just hanging there. You're just hanging there and you're waiting here. For what reason? I have no idea. <laughs> so let's get some more information here. I'm going to pull one more card here. What do my Geminis need to know for the middle of May? What information do my Geminis need to know? Like I said, someone has their self in a prison here an unnecessary prison you can get out at any time you can remove yourself but you and you're in your mind and you feel like you're entrapped you're look at this person they're holding and they can totally get out of this they can totally they, they look at the the straps that are, that is um around their hands it's not really it's not even really tied okay they can unloose these straps at any time okay so a lot of you guys are in your head you feel like you're in some type of um prison that you that you can't get out okay i think i'm gonna pull one more card here i'm gonna roll here with these cards so <laughs> all right Let's see what my Gemini needs to know. What do my Gemini needs to know? What information do my Gemini need to know? What information do my Gemini need to know? All right. Peace. You need to find peace. This is the Hierophant right here. And you need to find some inner peace. And you, you, you are going to find that, okay? You need to bring balance and calmness into your life. All right, Geminis. All right, Geminis. So that was my little mini spread. Okay, <laughs> let's get into my my babies here and find out what's really going on with you guys. Okay, what information do my Geminis need to know? What message do you want me to give my Geminis? Message do you want me to give my Geminis here? As soon as I get these cards, I start dropping them. Okay. What information do you want your guys to know? Alright. Someone is coming into some romance here. But you guys need to be cautious of this romance. This is a new lover that's coming in. Let's get some more information. <clears throat> Alright, Gemini's. do you want to give my Gemini's? What information do you want to give my Gemini's? All right, Gemini's. So you have a new lover coming in here. Someone that is coming in in the middle of June or they have, you have already um, met this person. 
Okay, you need to be cautious of this person, okay? Um, this isn't like a friend. Maybe you're starting off getting to know this person. They are not being, being who, um, they're not telling you the truth about who they are, okay? And their intentions, okay? Yeah, this is a jack of um, spades here. So this is someone you cannot rely on, someone who's not trustworthy, okay? They, they hold some type of energy. Maybe they have a good job or um, they run their own business here. You need to be um, careful of this person because there's new energy coming in towards this person, okay? Okay, what do my Geminis need to know? What do my Geminis need to know? What information do my Geminis need to know for the middle of May? Okay, so the new energy that's coming in is happiness, um, Geminis. Okay, there, there's just a little energy around this um, this new energy that's coming in, this person that you just met or whatever. Don't really, don't put all your eggs in one basket with them, okay? It's, it's okay to have conversations with people and just, you know, kind of putting yourself out there, letting the, the universe know that you want to get back out here, that you're, you are open to love. But whoever this new person is that is in your life right now, don't don't count on this person to be in your life for forever okay because this person is not bringing in good energy as far as a, a lover a new lover okay I, I i personally you guys got money coming in i personally will not in, even entertain this person okay just use them use this person as just the energy to kind of put just let the universe know okay and um universe i am ready for love and i am um open to um loving someone okay but you have finances coming in here, um, Gemini's. Whoa. Yes, you guys, if you guys entertain this person and get into a relationship with this person, there's going to be some issues around this person. This person is not who they say they are. They are lying. They are not true, trustworthy. They, they, okay, I'm picking up the energy that they're all about sex, okay? They just want to, they just want to get the goods, okay? And you guys don't even need to entertain someone that has, that you're, um, is sending up red flags okay this person is not going to be so conning that you all are not going to realize this okay there's going to be some red flags that come up with this person this individual and pay attention to it okay pay attention to them okay because you will have some issues with this person if you entertain this energy but you guys got your finances coming in you guys got happiness look at this the ten of hearts ten of hearts which is one of the most beautiful cards in this deck i'm just saying that everything you want is going to come to you okay you you are on the right path okay just get out of your, get out of your head get out of that um that oh woe is me that um, nothing's going to work out stop entrapping yourself in a fake prison okay because it's not true Okay, your money, everything's going to start flowing in for you here, Gemini's. Yes, there's going to be some burden surrounding um, this individual that's coming in. Okay, <clears throat> let's get another spread here, Gemini's. Pick up some, on some more energy here, okay? All right, what message do you have for my Gemini's? What message do you have for my Gemini's? What message do you have for my Gemini's in the middle of May here? What message do you have for my Gemini's? It's Jack of Diamonds. Yes, he's a, this person, he, she, I'm picking up a male energy though. They're not reliable. They are a liar. They have like a, a very young way of approaching relationships that very, um, you know, I got you. I'm, I'm gonna do. I'm, I want you, and I want this person too. Okay. Um, <clears throat> okay. This cards want to come out before. There's some. There's gonna be some domestic issues surrounding this person. Okay. Or you guys are going through some domestic. Going to go through some domestic issues or um, legal issues with this person. I don't know if they're coming in as violent. Um, okay. Let me let me put some more energy on this in um, this person. Give me some more energy messages for this person what do my gemini's need to know what do my gemini's need to know as burdens 
disappointments, changes, lies, betrayal is coming through with this new individual. Don't entertain this person. Don't get into a relationship with this person, okay? They're not bringing any good energy. This is not the person that you're supposed to be dealing with right now, okay? I think I told all my zodiacs this before, but right now you guys need to focus on yourself. You guys are coming out of some, some toxic ass relationships and you're jumping into something new. It's okay to entertain people as like friends and getting to know the opposite sex. But right now, you guys, don't don't just latch on to anyone right now, okay? Don't latch on, latch on to anyone new right now, okay? Give it some time. But you guys got beautiful. Your, your finances is coming in very strong here for um, the month of um, uh, middle of July. I mean, the middle of June into July here. You guys got some money coming in, all right? <clears throat> Let's get some more information here. What do my Geminis need to know? It is their birthday month. Happy birthdays, Gemini. I'm so sorry. I forgot to tell you guys that I love you guys. I really love my Geminis. You guys are like dear to my heart here. All right, but you, you guys got some type of female energy around you. Some dark um, energy around you guys. <sighs> Let's pull on this woman. Who is this? Who is this woman here? What information do my Geminis need to know about this person? Who is this woman? This dark woman. What information? Ugh. All right, you guys, come on. It's like they, they don't. It's like the energy is like, okay, just be watchful of this person. But I want more information. Just burden surrounding this person, okay? Guys, hold on to your finances. When you guys have that money coming in, hold on to that the, your finances because they're towards the end of June. June here, you guys could have start having a little issues with some finances here. I don't know if someone is going through some legal issues right now, but you guys just hold on to that money. You guys have money flowing into you guys, but I want you guys to put that money away, okay? Okay, Gemini's, put that money away. Save some of that money. Interference here. You have some dark female. And I have been picking up on this on this energy all week. A lot of my zodiacs have some dark energy, some energy that's been thrown out to you guys. Somebody is doing some dark magic. Someone is uh, um, upset. Somebody, someone is afraid, um, envious of your success and what you have and what you have going on. And there is a lot of dark magic being thrown out. Um, just on my zodiac signs, period. Yes, there is a change coming. Keep saying it's the same thing. Okay, you're getting some type of natural assistance here. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Okay, just you guys need to be careful. Just be watchful of, of female energy. Okay, this person is around you. This person is very envious of you. Okay, this person is very envious of you. You guys just need to be watchful of this person because I get the feeling that someone is having some dark magic throw at them. I'm not trying to scare you, Gemini's, but I have to put it, I have to put that energy out if it's being shown to me. Okay. Yeah, there is some burdens, some disappointments surrounding a male. There is burdens, disappointments surrounding. You guys got some news when it comes to your money, but you need to be watchful. You need to be watchful here. You need to be watchful of this female energy, and you need to be watchful of any anyone that is coming into your life, and you're just getting to know them, okay? Whoever this person is, they are not going to maintain, stay in your life. This person is not up to it. They're not a good person okay they're coming in with that young mentality like you know i can have you i can have this person i can have that and th to me they're coming off to me as if they just want sex from you okay they're gonna probably lie to you and tell you that they're this they're that and you know y'all laugh and y'all having some fun and you really are connected with this person but this person is full of shit you have some female energy around you you guys have this woman in your life okay this is not someone who's kind of like they're, they're hiding in the shadows because they're throwing the dark magic at you, but you know them. You know this person. Like, this person is in your life, okay? 
All right, let's get some messages from my other cards here. Whoa. <clears throat> Okay, you have the three of springs. Plan your next step with an eye to the long term. Have patience, Gemini's. You guys are feeling like to get out of your head. Get out of your head, Gemini's. You're too intelligent for that. Get out of your head. Stop feeling like you're trapped and there is no way to turn. You guys need to raise your vibration. By by you guys need to raise your vibration and really stay focused on what you're trying to do in life, okay? Start planning. Put that plan forth, okay? It is going to work out for you guys, I'm, I'm telling you. Take steps to ensure the fun. What I was just saying, you guys, okay, you guys have money coming in here, but that money is for you to put away for hard times, for a financial, um, financial, stabilities okay when you put money away and you have that just sitting there you're never going to be broke <laughs> you know what i mean because you're like you're saving you're putting your money away when stuff go wrong with your car when a bill is due if you come into some some money um issues you have money that you can go back to this money is coming in for you guys in the uh, middle of june the end of june so you all can be financially stable okay whatever finances put some of that money away Okay, pay your bills and put some money away. Okay, it's, it, this card came out the Ten of Autumns. It says, take steps to ensure the financial security of your children and other loved ones. Okay, you guys need to ask help for others. Okay, you guys are wearing a lot of hats. You guys got a lot of shit going on, a lot of mental um, burdens going on here. You guys don't, you guys don't believe in yourself. You're doubting yourself because you're in some type of situation or you're having some little, maybe you're having some money issues right now and you don't think that it's going to work out or you're going through some stuff. But you guys need to um, reach out for some assistance, like reach out to people who you know care about you, who can help you, okay? Because anything you do, if you're reaching out for some financial assistance or anything, that is going to come through for you guys, okay? It's like the ball is in your, your hand. A windfall of money is coming in. Look at this. You got, What did I keep saying? You guys have some finances coming in, but whatever finances is coming in for you guys, please put that money away, okay? Put some of that money away, okay? All right, my Geminis, let's get the reading from the gods here and see what they have to say. Right. What message do you have, my Gemini's? What message do you have, my Gemini's? Leap of faith. Take the risk, okay? And put your heart's true desire into action. Look at this. Take a risk, Gemini's. Get yourself out of that rut, okay? Only you can do that. Nobody, the universe is just going to send you these messages and tell you like, okay, it's time to get moving. You guys have to put your foot forth and do this, okay? You can, Gemini's. You got this. Believe in yourself. Get yourself out of that. that get, get yourself out of your head, Gemini's. You have been indoors for too long, Gemini's, okay? Go outside and get some fresh air. I, can, I told you guys this before. Like, get out here in nature. What do y'all think? I'm just... I'm just coming on here feeding y'all a whole bunch of bullshit. No, I don't. I don't have. To, I don't do that. You know what I mean? I I come on here and I really have a message to deliver. This these messages, and I feel it very strong. You guys need to get out here in fucking nature. It's nice. It's, it's you know close to summer here. Get out here. Walk barefoot. Get your feet. If you don't like walking barefoot, put your socks on. Just get your get your feet. Get your body close to nature okay get your body clear it's going to help recharge you it's going to give you downloads of messages that's coming through okay that's why these cards keep coming out saying you guys need to get out here in nature okay you are a channel for divine healing somebody has some spiritual gifts and the universe is constantly pushing you trying to tell you to do it. Take a leap of faith. Put your energy out here. People need you. People are counting on you guys, Gemini. It's the medicine woman. Some of you guys have some spiritual gifts and you're sitting on it. You're sitting on it and the universe ain't having it. it people need you. Okay. People need that healing from you, Gemini's. Okay. This is for somebody directly. Okay. 
It says home. Your household situation is improving, proving either through a move or a healthy change. Once things change, once you make that that decision to change, to take that leap, to do what you're you're meant to do, everything is going to fall into place. Stop worrying. Stop worrying about your household. It's going to be okay, Gemini's. It's going to be okay. Okay, the universe got your back. Okay, let's get one more card here from the gods. What do my Gemini's need to know? Right. It says, ask others to help you. Okay? Instead of trying to do everything for yourself, it's okay, Gemini's, to ask for some help. Reach out for the reach out for some assistance. Okay. Reach out for some assistance. There are people who's who are around you. Or um, that you have met that will help you out, Gemini's. Just you guys are doing too much. And that's why you're all in your head. It's like, I got to do this. Okay, this got to be taken care of. Okay, they need to go here. They, you know, ask for help, Gemini's. It's okay. Okay. No one's going to think you're less of a person because you ask for some assistance. Okay. All right, let me get one more card from here, y'all. You know, I think I'm a shit now and I can read these cards. <laughs> I used to hate these type of cards, but I don't know. Recently, I just I've been drawn to them, and I just I love the pictures. I love the um, information. Okay, this card right here. This is the King of Pentacles. Okay, just from the picture alone here, um, this is representing the male energy or the female energy that I was picking up earlier, um, and that you are entertaining right now. This person likes to have their cake and eat it too. Okay, as you can see, this person has a, um, it's a, like a chocolate cake here and like they ate, then they got their wine, they're kind of like greedy here. Um, people may look at this card in a different way, but I go off the energy that is being presented to me at this moment. And this, whoever this energy is, and I told you guys this before, this person likes to have it all. You know what I mean? They like to have this person, that person, and you. Okay, they like the cake and eat it too, so you guys be watchful of this person here, Okay. <clears throat> All right, give me one more card for my Gemini's. Give me one more card for my Gemini's. Okay, let me see. This is a nine of, of wands here. This is the nine of wands here. And it's like you're, you're, you, 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 it's like you're not giving up here, but you, you, you have been doing a lot. It's like you're, you're almost like, it's almost like you're going into battle and you're tired and you're restless, but you're not giving up here. You're not giving up. You're, you're, you're continuing the fight. Okay. And you can see the swords are down here and there's like smoke. It's like you're you constantly, you keep trying. It's like it's a lot of energy. There's a lot of things coming at you and you're not giving up here. You're, you're down for the fight, but you're tired. You're tired, okay? <clears throat> Let's get one more card from here. All right. I see this card. I had a vision of this card. Look, you guys have, you guys are birthing just like happiness here. Goldfish means fortune. It means transformation. It means abundance here. Okay. You guys are coming into this. Look at this. It's the water. It's the flowing of emotions. It's the flowing of intuitiveness. It's the flowing of abundantness. Okay. And it's like you, you're going to have it all. You're going to have it all, Gemini's. Okay. You guys just need to believe you have abundance coming to you. I see a lot of abundance coming to my Gemini's. Okay. Let me get one more card, Gemini's. Just for your birthday, I'll give you one more card here. All right. Going on your own path here. This is the page of wands. As you can see, this person is like looking back. Somebody like this cat, like they're, they're just leaving all the shit behind and they're just leaving things. They're going on their own path here. Okay. They're not following someone else's path. They're following their path. They're not confused. As you can see, they're looking back like, mm, yeah, you go there and I got my own shit I got to do. Okay, going on your own path here, taking a leap of faith here, Gemini's taking a leap of faith here. I'm going to stop whenever I get the cue to stop here, Gemini's. <clears throat> All right, you ready? Look at this. This person like there is the there they see the bullshit here. They see the battle that they're and they're ready. They're ready for a fight. They're ready. They're ready for to go after what they want. 
okay and you guys need to see that this is the knight of wands here okay and it's like this person is looking at the battle that they have to face here and they're ready look he got his sword here he got his wand here i said sword he has his wand here and as you can see there's energy coming from this wand because that 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 wand because they're ready they're like what's up like let's go get out go take that leap stop being fearful Gemini, stop being fearful. Get out of your head and do it. This is the message from the ancestors, from the spirits, okay? You guys need to take that leap and get out of your head, Gemini. This is like this is like my fourth reading with you all, and it's constantly saying the same thing. You guys need to take a leap. You need to get your asses out here in the nature. Quit entertaining relationships right now. That is going to come in for you. But whoever you're entertaining now or who's coming in is not the person. I don't care how good of a connection y'all got. I don't care how strong the connection is. They are not for you, okay? Focus on you. Right now, you need to just be focused on you taking that leap, okay? Get out your head.